What is up you guys? It is Dragonfly Todd coming at you with a brand new video and this is game news episode 9 I think so if you guys do enjoy this series make sure you go ahead and leave a like also make sure you comment and subscribe because I do things like this a lot and I talk about a certain number of games you know whatever I think of and uh, yeah so this is identity and this is actually one of the most recent development live streams that they've done and as you can see guys they are definitely working on the game they show a number of different assets and environments and stuff like that in this video if you guys do want to go see the whole thing make sure you go ahead and check out their twitch account it's identity rpg and yeah they show uh they show off a car motown actually creates a an iphone model in the game so that we you know we can have phones inside the game i know everybody wants a phone and uh, this is the like the art gallery before, but this is the reading room that's in the uh, library. Actually, I'm not sure that, but it looked like the library before actually too. But it had like art gallery banners and stuff up, like that. So this this like this actually looks really really detailed. And there's a, a certain number of like different assets and stuff that I'm about to show you right now. Like just look at the amount of detail that is on this table. You got like the, all these different shaders that this French guy, this French developer that he's made, he's put in all a lot of effort into these like assets and different things like a parking meter and even the signs look pretty good. I'm just saying that identity graphic wise it's going to look pretty good and hopefully everyone will have a PC that can actually run the game so that we can have a lot of people in the game. All you Dragonfly Todd fans out there, the 430 or whatever I have now, yeah. Hopefully I'll see all you guys in game on identity. So now we're going to move into the next game. So if you guys are not aware, the Star Citizen 3.0 update was supposed to hit around this time in June, but it actually has been delayed till August and this, this update is going to bring a ton of different stuff to the game. Uh, there's going to be a lot of more, a lot of improvements and even planetary exploration. So I'm really excited for this update to actually hit, so that we can play Star Citizen uh, at least to half of what it's meant to be. So Star Citizen is, it's going to be pretty good. It's, it's obviously, it's already better than No Man's Sky just because you can play with your friends. And there's a lot of problems on that standpoint as well. I try to play with friends and it just gets so burnt out because it's hard to find your friends and there's no marker actually telling you where your friends are at so you have to just you have to like coordinate to what struts and what uh, landing pads you're on and then whenever you do find your friends there's really not that much to do other than fighting pirates in space or doing different quests with them that you actually get in the game but with the star citizen 3.0 update you'll be able to do a lot more stuff with your friends and there will be a lot of ships that are added and stuff like that within the update so if you guys do want to go ahead and get star citizen i would pick that up it's pretty it's pretty good the graphics are good and i'm just waiting for 3.0 update honestly because it's going to be pretty good i am actually in a um a group in star citizen it's called evo corp um, yeah, it's just like my corporation and identity, but it's led by Alpha, and he actually is a leader of a different corp and identity as well. So if you guys do want to check that out, yeah, just hit me up, and I can get you into the Discord. So with that, I'm only going to talk about these two games today because a lot of different stuff has happened, such as you know the Assassin's Creed, a uh, bunch of the, a bunch of the gameplay footage. I'm seeing it everywhere. I'm sure stuff has happened on Ashes of Creation. You guys can go check out the Assassin's Creed stuff. And there's also been like a Battlefield or not a Battlefield, but a Battlefront Star Wars Battlefront gameplay video dropped, and that was around E3. So if you guys do want to go check all that out, you can look it up on YouTube just as easy as I can. But there's not really much to talk about in those big titles because most of the information is already out there. So you guys can find that. But anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter. Leave a like, drop a comment, and subscribe for more. Peace.